It's the 10th of December 1948 and the UN General Assembly adopts the Universal Declaration of Human Rights. It states that all human beings are born free and equal in dignity and rights. Yet fast forward to 2011 and the UN Human Rights Council expresses grave concern at acts of violence and discrimination based on sexual orientation and gender identity. All over the world, lesbian, gay, bisexual and transgender or LGBT people are still being subjected to discrimination and acts of brutal violence, torture, kidnapping, even murder. In 76 countries, same-sex relationships are criminalized in violation of basic rights. These abuses must end. The tide is turning. Since 1990, almost 40 countries have legalized same-sex relationships. Many more have lawfully banned discrimination against LGBT people. More and more countries now recognize the urgency and are pressing for action at the UN. In the past four years, this has led to the first adopted UN resolution on the issue, the first official UN report, and the first formal intergovernmental debate at the UN Human Rights Council. On the 26th of July 2013, the UN launched Free and Equal, a global campaign designed to raise awareness of homophobic and transphobic violence and discrimination and to help stop millions of LGBT people being abused for being who they are. We must protect the basic human rights of LGBT people. But it doesn't just require changes in laws and policies. It takes changes in people's hearts and minds. Like the struggle against racism, like the struggle for gender equality, the struggle for LGBT equality will only be won if we join together if we speak out, if we stand in the defense of the rights of others. The time to do this is now. Together, we can stop violence and discrimination against LGBT people. Together, we can build a world that is free and equal.